Now that we got our first widgets out of the way, it's time for us to start talking about how they look like. And the way that the way it works in jQuery, if we go back into the jQuery UI website, um, as you hopefully noticed when you were downloading the custom download, and you haven't done that already, then please do. When you click on to download a custom download, you see the beyond the selections that control the JavaScript side, they control also the CSS side. Now, the first thing that I want you to note is that when you look at the bottom of the themes themselves, when you could select a theme, you'll see there's a lot of different types of themes. Now, in our case, for example, if we wanted to use smooth in this theme, if we're actually going to look into our code currently inside of our application, we'll see that currently we're using the theme base. Now, we're still loading every single thing in the jQuery library. We're both loading every single thing in the CSS that it has to offer and everything in the um, JavaScript that it has to offer. Now, on the JavaScript end, we don't have to ever change anything when we change themes. The themes are 100% controlled through CSS. With that said, it's really, really easy to just immediately convert every single thing you have inside of your, your theme itself, completely change the visuals of it by just changing this folder. So if you're using the jQuery.com CDN file, which I hope you are currently, you can very easily just change the theme. And I want to show you how to do that really, really easily. So first of all, you could look inside of the website itself and basically choose the, the element you want. 